My name is Elida Osafo. Like everybody has that term before, technology addiction. So how is mechanism work that underlies technology addiction? What is addiction? Addiction is a brain disease that negatively affects people, mental, physical and social life. Here we shouldn't confuse habit with addiction. Habit is a written behavior, but addiction is a brain disease. Why addiction is a brain disease? Some chemical substances are powerful enough to make an addiction. As an example, morphine. Postoperative patients are given morphine, but they don't leave the hospital as a drug addict. But when we take this chemical out of hospital, we come up against addiction. People is the same people. Substance is the same substance. When you think about that, we can understand why addiction is a brain disease. What are the symptoms of addiction? There are a range of symptoms and changeable by person. But in general, an ability to stop using, obsession, isolating, and disruptive sleep patterns, continued use in the face of adverse consequences, etc. Red Park, idea of addiction, dates back to the 20th century. In this experiment, we put the rats in cage and we gave them two options, pre water and cocaine water. We saw mostly rats choose the cocaine water. But Professor Alexander, we considered about that experiment and he discerned we put the rats in empty cage there is no choice to drink cocaine water. And he made red park. That includes some balls, cheese, and the important thing, friends. And again, he gave them two options, cocaine water and pure water. Incredibly, he saw that rats didn't drink cocaine water. This experiment, I mean red park, you and new a perspective to us. Why do we get addicted? When you do something that makes you happy, nucleus accumbens is stimulated and amount of dopamine in your brain increases. Accordingly, you want to do it again. We call that system reward and punishment system. What will happen? if we have a reward and punishment system. Let me explain this with experiments. We implant the electrode to rat's brain, I mean nucleus accumbens, and when the rat pedal, uh, nucleus accumbens is stimulated, amount of dopamine in rat's brain increases and rat gets happy. Accordingly, rats want to do it again. In this experiment, we expect that sometimes rats pedal and get happy. But unfortunately, we saw that rats drop everything, like an eat or drink. End of the experiment, unfortunately, rat died. The pedals in front of us, like buttons. In social media, when you like somebody's photos, posts, or tweets, they're gonna be happy. But don't forget that you're gonna be happy too. In here, the dangerous thing is showing tolerance. Example, you are happy with two legs today, but tomorrow you won't. You want to more like. So let's remember the rat pedal experiment. If we prevent something like addiction, first we should know what is it. And we read more, we experiment more, and we learn more. Thank you for listening to me.